is seeking shame. And I sing because I sing On your profession of faith in the finished work of Jesus Christ's death, burial, and resurrection among this body of baptized believers and in the presence of demons and angels and with the world observing in interest and desire to witness as the apostles were taught through the blood of Jesus, we've been redeemed. Yes. And in his name, every knee must bow. Yes. And every tongue must confess Amen. that he is Lord. Yes. And accordingly, we baptize you. Yes. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. One time, victory is mine. Victory is mine. Victory today is mine. I told Satan, get thee behind. Victory today is mine. Happiness is mine. Happiness is mine. Happiness today. I told Satan, get thee behind. Happiness today is mine. Clap your hand, clap your hand, clap your hand. There's room at the cross for you, though millions have come, there's yet room for one. If there's one today, under the sound of our voice, that would like to be among the number of the baptized, if your life is in need of the cleansing blood of Jesus, or the comfort and assurance that you are in good standing with the Son of God and with the Father, you can come to this water right now, turn this into an altar, you need to be baptized. Maybe you've never been baptized. Then you should be as Jesus taught. Maybe you were baptized. You didn't even know what happened. You don't even remember it. You weren't even a believer. You weren't even understanding what occurred. There's no better time than right now. You can step right up to this fountain. And we won't do it today unless it's urgent. But in not many days hence, not only will your name be written in heaven, but you will be numbered among those that have followed Jesus into the watery grave and arisen with a testimony. Thank you, Jesus. And I want to just let you know, as they say in the other church on Mount Nebo, the doors of the church are open. They're not open by the priest or the pastor or the prophet or the apostle, but they were opened by the blood of Jesus when he gave his life on Calvary died for us, went into the grave, arose from the dead that we might not only be forgiven, but we could be set free and live in the abundant life. Thank you, Jesus. And I want to just give you a chance. Anybody here on this side, that side, 
young, old, member or non-member, though millions have come, there's no better time than now. Just tell him, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We're standing. Thank you.